my fellow Dream Chasers and Disney fans across the world, and welcome to the latest episode of Kingdom of Isolation. Where in times of trouble, why not isolate yourself with the magic of Disney? We're still in the World War II era. I don't have my mum with me today. I'm recording this on December the 8th. Uh, I've only got a handful of these left. To, I've only got a handful of the World War II films left to um, uh, to do. I'm calling it World War II films because, because it was just... The World War, the, the package film era, where it was just nothing but package films. Saludos Amigos, Three Amigos, Make My Music, uh, Fun and Fancy Free, Melody Time, and The Adventures of Vicobot and Mr. Toad. Uh, but stay tuned on Christmas Eve, where there's going to be a Christmas special of Kingdom of Isolation, where me and one of my friends, uh, who you'll have seen, who you'll have uh, heard on uh, a previous, a uh, couple of previous episodes, uh, where we talked about uh, Bambi and Dumble, Michael McGorry from movies and milk uh we're gonna be talking about the nightmare before christmas that was gonna be my uh halloween special and i was gonna do muppet christmas carol for the christmas film this year but don't worry i've already got it penciled in muppet christmas carol christmas 2021 so nevertheless here we go so the next film in this um on this uh, kingdom of isolation journey is make mine music released in 19 19- 46 it is the it is the first film released post world war 2 but they were still only able to make uh package films because there were still issues trying to get to the international markets so nevertheless let's not waste any more time i've only got about an hour to deal with this so let's get started <laughs> That's interesting there, you've got the cre- opening credits with the, uh, the voice talents. They are on a skyscraper, which I can only assume is akin to that of the uh, Empire State Building. This this was a, this was a staple back in the day. So you had the uh, you had the, you had the choir singing of the uh, opening credits. So a lot of those names worked on previous films, like uh, the, some of the previous films that I've already covered. Uh, I mean, Hugh Fraser, one of those names in particular, they worked on Pinocchio, and then you had Sterling Holloway, who was one of the voices in uh, Dumbo. And he would go on to voice quite a few other characters in future Disney projects. Now, obviously, I can't show the footage because copyright issues. Every time the film was uh, going to be re-released, but in the end, they decided to settle for just re-releasing the original film in um, in, uh, in standard standard sound effects. Yeah, this has been used on many occasions throughout um, 
Disney history, and they're, and they're still able to, they're still able to do it. They're still able to do a multiplayer camera digitally in the um, in the computer animated in the uh, CG films. And we have ourselves a cream. Uh, I can't. Re I can't really risk having the audio of the film in the background, so that's why I've got the uh, royalty-free music uh, in the in the background, just just to be on the safe side. I'll be taking that, thank you very much. <laughs> She's not too happy. A little bit of scat singing, eh? Well, it, that, that is sort of a pussy. <laughs> Goodbye. Missed out the D. Ah! I can't see! Oh no! Oh no! Kazunta! Okay, 
Oh. <laughs> Shoes. <laughs> oh, bless him. Whee! Oh. Oh! Ah! Wait for me! Right, now you can go. Th that's clever. Ah! My shoes! How are they going to fit them all in? I just realized that. How are they going to fit them all in? Nah, uh, the cops, nah, uh, surely the cops would have stopped them there. The cops would have stopped them because there was too many people in the car. Oh, that's just me. Nope. Ice cream the fuck me does have Wait, what? Ah, oh, sandwiches. Okay. And he's stuck with it all over. Ah, that sucks. Uh oh, that's more like. Ooh. Yeah, that particular part ain't gonna fly today. <laughs> they did that dirty dancing lift before dirty dancing. And we've got some more sketches. Uh oh. And there goes the
cold without you, but... Apart from, apart from the Go bottom of the, the lawyer, bottom of the ninth. Two out. Put up even money now. We're Casey the Roll credits. Ah, but Flynn preceded Casey. Of all the stupid guys, the bat is getting in his head. Now the head is getting in his back. I don't know if it's me or not, but there's something about this that doesn't really make much sense. Oh, 
Oh, for goodness sake. Focus on the game, then you can admire the ladies. Yeah, do not mess with the umpire. Oh boy! Dating. So they're not even going to show us how they how the baseball game finished. What happens when you get too cocky, Casey? Yeah, the game finished like two minutes ago. Open eye, 
Feel the waves cut through me, hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in. Hold tight, hold tight, chemicals collide. Hold tight, hold tight, hold tight. Dripping lights paint the sky. the live action and the animation, even back in 1946, 1945 when this was released, when this was filmed, and then released in as well, what an ad. That seg segment. Who's gonna? I mean, how many kids are actually gonna pay attention to that segment? section of this film that anyone remembers if they've seen it.
get that in the move without the wolf, would it? Oh God, how's that gonna do any damage to the wolf? same music that's used in the uh, Walt Disney Mini Classics uh, trailer for, for Peter and the Wolf. Nice little fact right there for you folks. was uh, entered into the 
your book will get the key and sing the story to Hatfields and McCoy's and Hatfields and McCoy's style for you. And the mountains broken up when two young people from each side inadvertently are oh, basically Romeo and Juliet. Second, we go to the census and the video release management of the section of the film. Yeah, that definitely didn't fly today. Uh oh, uh oh. Very, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Just run! Yeah, just run! Very dark turn. That took a very dark turn. How's that and gonna help? This, eh? How about this? Eh? Not so good. Eh? To get off good that work, I don't think that's gonna work. Sasha. Sasha, get up. Get up. Get out of this. From a bird's eye view. You should go feathers. Two down. Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, 
yeah, this is and well. And now we've got nowhere left to go. Wait a minute, recycled animation. Hey! Who, who, and who? <laughs> Must be some sort of Russian or Soviet It would have been the back in the Anyway. Wait, what? Yeah. 
very abstract. This, this stuff. Feels more jazz than anything else.
there is a lot of jazz music. Oh no, I'm thinking of Ned Washington.
Oh, still doing the way up there. Second or two behind. Last success, they just over the way. At least. Willie, 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 look. That's you, Willie. He's looking for you. It's your big opportunity. Willie's going to be a great star. Our Willie, going to sing grand up. Goodbye, my friends. I'm off to be discovered. La, 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 la. The endless hours of faithful practice are about to be rewarded. As well as back to the office, he wondered what his descent was going to become. What would he expect him to be sorry of? How about this? He got old. And Jerry and the beginning of Mrs. Delphire. Delicita, delicita, delicita. La 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 la
Okay. actually swallowed three. Remember, one tenor, one baritone, one bass. Bravo! A bravo from everyone. about this whale. Makes it on to Time Across, across the world. That took a dark turn would be an understatement.
somewhat got a happy ending. He's still able to keep singing. All the in the great ultra in the sky. And e even there it's sold out. Okay, so, overall, not the best from that era, but definitely not the worst. Now we have, I've got, I've got the scores in front of me, so let's do the numbers very quickly. Story, had to give a 2, unfortunately. Characters, a 1, because... Actually, make it a two because of Peter and the Wolf. Visuals are six. Some of them, I say, things like the Blue Bayou segment, just. <sighs> soundtrack, probably the only good thing about it. I mean, shock and horror, me praising a soundtrack. That was an eight. Test of time, a measly two. So that gives us an overall score of 40%. So there we go, not much we can do about that. I mean, let's say the only segments I can really keep note of are the... Um, Peter and the Wolf and the Whale Who Wanted to Sing at the Met. Those are the only two segments that... I mean, if you just combined those two together, then... If you combined those two together and just left everything else out, then, yeah, this this would have been great for a, a TV special. I mean, this, would been, this would have been great for TV, but... Hey, how I don't work at Disney, I wouldn't know a thing. But nevertheless, that is it, folks, uh, for this episode of Mi um, Kingdom of Isolation. The next episode is going to involve, I believe, Let's see. List of Walt Disney's Pictures films. That's what we need. Um, at least that's what we're after. Yeah, fun and fancy free. Next. And I'll be taking care of that tomorrow. In the meantime, thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed what you saw, hit the thumbs up. And if you want to be a dream chaser like myself, hit the subscribe button down at the bottom and click the bell to join the Dream Chasers notification squad so you don't miss anything I do on this channel. You can check out my previous episode of, I want to say, because of where I'm situated on the camera, uh, up on the top right you can see my previous episode of Kingdom of Isolation where we tackled the three caballeros and we've got the Kingdom of Isolation playlist on the bottom right. But in the meantime, hope you enjoyed what you saw. This is Kenzie Retro of the Accessible Gaming Network signing off. Thank you and good night.